If you've been paying even a little attention to the EV space lately, you know the competition is intensifying. While Tesla has long held the crown with the Model Y, it now faces serious competition from newcomers particularly from China. One of the most intriguing challengers is the Sears 5, a fully electric SUV that recently made its European debut after launching in China in 2019. They had the chance to drive the Sears 5 and, naturally, couldn't resist putting it head-to-head -head against the Tesla Model Y. Although they only had access to the pre-facelift Model Y, as the new Juniper update wasn't yet available for test drives in Greece, it still offered a solid benchmark. So, how does the Sears 5 stack up? Design and presence, familiar versus fresh. Aesthetics are subjective, but they still play a big role in car buying decisions. Both SUV blend coupe-like curves with crossover practicality, but parked side by side, the Sears 5 arguably has more curb appeal. Tesla's Model Y, often described as a bloated Model 3, has become ubiquitous in many regions, and its design, while clean, lacks novelty. The recent Juniper update has freshened things up a bit, but it's still unmistakably a Tesla. The Sears 5, on the other hand, feels more premium and unique. It turns heads in ways the Model Y rarely does these days. That said, its rear design is a bit busy compared to Tesla's more cohesive finish. Still, the Sears 5's sharper lines and more aggressive stance give it a contemporary edge. Cabin experience, minimalism refined. Step inside either vehicle, and you'll immediately notice Tesla's influence. Both cabins are minimalist, feature a massive central screen, and have very few physical controls. But while Tesla set the trend, Sears might be executing it better. The Sears 5 interior uses higher quality materials, stylish color schemes, and a better thought-out layout. The presence of a digital instrument cluster and head-up display also makes transitioning from a traditional car easier. Tesla, while futuristic, continues to polarize users by placing everything, including the speedometer, on the central screen. Where Tesla wins, though, is with its software ecosystem. Regular over-the-air updates keep the interface modern and smooth, offering features like advanced route planning, streaming entertainment, and vehicle customization. The Sears 5's infotainment system is solid, but it lacks Tesla's polish and continuous evolution. Looks like we are well into this video we would like to welcome you to the Electric Explorer, your go-to spot for all things electric. We dive deep into the world of electric vehicles, from the latest models and tech to industry trends and sustainability efforts. Whether you're an EV enthusiast, or just starting to explore, we've got you covered with reviews, news, and insights that will keep you plugged into the future of driving. So, hit that subscribe button, buckle up, and let's charge forward together. Practicality, Tesla's home turf. When it comes to space and storage, Tesla remains the champion, despite its sloping roof line. The Model Y offers better rear headroom and legroom, making it easier for adults to get comfortable in the back seats. It also provides a class-leading cargo capacity, 29 cubic feet, 822 liters, in the rear and another for 0.1 cubic feet, 114 liters, up front. By comparison, the Sears 5 offers a modest 13 cubic feet, 367 liters, in the trunk and a smaller frunk of 2.4 cubic feet, 67 liters. While that's not terrible, it's a notable step down for families, who prioritize storage, performance and ride comfort. Let's talk numbers. On paper, the Sears 5 packs 193 more horsepower than the Model Y and feels like a muscle car in disguise. It's smooth, refined, and excels in comfort. Its suspension setup is plush, soaking up road imperfections with ease, making it better suited for city cruising or long-distance drives. The Tesla, in contrast, is sharper and more dynamic. Its chassis is better tuned for twisty roads, and the steering feels more connected. Despite being less powerful, the Model Y actually feels quicker off the line. With more immediate acceleration, 062 miles per hour in 4.2 seconds versus 5.0 seconds for the Sears. Tesla's rear bias to WD system gives it a more engaging feel for spirited drivers. Charging and range. The Model Y edges ahead in range and charging speed. It boasts 32 miles, 51 kilometers, more WLTP range, and supports 250 kilowatt DC fast charging which significantly reduces downtime on long trips. The Sears 5 makes is out at 100 kW, making it slower to recharge. While these figures may not seem critical for urban use, for road trippers and frequent travelers, Tesla's supercharger network and faster recharging times make a big difference. Value for money. Here's where things get interesting. In Greece, the fuss-lifted Tesla Model Y long range at WD starts at €52,990, $58,100, 
or 43,990 euros, $48,200, with incentives. Inventory units of the outgoing version are available for even less, starting at 48,940 euros, $53,600. The Sears 5, meanwhile, costs 57,500 euros, $63,000, including incentives. That's a 13,510 euros, $14,800, premium over the base model Y Juniper with similar specs. If you consider the older Tesla inventory units, the gap becomes even wider. Final thoughts, can Sears beat the benchmark? The Sears 5 is impressive, especially considering it's the brand's first major foray into the EV market. It brings a more refined interior, a smoother ride, and a fresh design. For those seeking comfort and a more premium cabin feel, it has real appeal. However, the Tesla Model Y remains the better all-rounder. It's more practical, more affordable, charges faster, and drives better, especially if you enjoy spirited driving. While Sears delivers a polished product, beating Tesla at its own game is no small feat. That said, Tesla is facing growing resistance in Europe, largely due to negative sentiments surrounding CEO Elon Musk. His controversial behavior appears to be driving some buyers toward alternatives like the Sears 5. If that trend continues, newer entrants could gain traction not just on merit, but on public perception as well. In short, if you're shopping for an EV SUV, the Model Y is still hard to beat, but the Sears 5 makes a compelling case for those looking